Discover how thousands of YouTubers are making a full-time income. Go to BeATubeBoss.com or click the link in the description. Welcome to another quick movie review. I just watched Return to House on Haunted Hill. All right. Now, this movie came out in 2007 and is apparently a sequel to House on Haunted Hill, which came out in 1999. They came out with the sequel, which I didn't even know, man. I, I must be slipping. But back in the day, I must have been slipping because I did not know they came out with a sequel because I'm, I'm surely I would have watched it, right? Surely I would have watched it. But anyway, I just saw it. Uh, I saw it on Amazon Prime. Um, and it's weird because they got the same movie that said it came out in 2007. Then they got another version of the same movie, but it says it came out in 2016. So I don't know what the difference is, but I watched it on Prime from 2007. All right. So anyway, this is a follow up to House on Haunted Hill. If you didn't see House on Haunted Hill, the first one, it's a pretty good movie. It's about these people who get trapped in this house um, from this evil doctor, basically. He sets these people up. And basically, they can't get out the house, blah, blah, blah. So we move to the sequel. All right, so basically, you get all these people that has to, that goes back into this, you know, this big-ass haunted house. And they all trying to look for this little statue thing that's worth a ton of money. And obviously, they get stuck in this house. The house is full of ghosts, full of evil, full of booby traps, right? So the idea is for everybody to figure out how the hell we're going to get out this house. So you got little clicks, you know what I'm saying? You got, you know, this group of people versus this group of people, but they got to They got to try to work together to get up out this house. Right. So, um, yeah, in my opinion, I liked it. You know what I mean? Like it has everything you want in a horror movie. It's dark. It has a little funny moments. It has this cheesy moments. It got the little the little love story in it. All that stuff, man. It, it has everything you want um, in a horror movie. Could have been a little scarier. Obviously, a lot of movies could be uh, a, a little scarier, except Annabelle 3. Annabelle 3 is scary as hell. But um, yeah, overall, I like this movie. If you are a fan of horror movies or if you like me and liked uh, House on Haunted Hill, the first one, and didn't know they had a sequel, you definitely, I think you would like this movie. All right. So with all that being said, I'm going to give... Uh, return to House on Haunted Hill a 4 out of 5 that's right maybe it's not a 4 maybe I should say 3 I, I'm going to give it a 3.5 3 because 4 you know you, you got you to gotta bring a little more to be a 4 but yeah 3.5 definitely I give that uh, if you watched Return to House on Haunted Hill you already know the deal comment below and let me know what you think one thing I know is people gon' hate, gon' hate. One day I'ma blow and I just can't wait, can't wait. See, they want me to quit, but I just cannot stop.